Let's try on some really highly rated maternity jeans. Let's try them on. We have cheap, we have mid, and then we have expensive. Let's see how they feel, how they fit, how they look, and do they support the belly? That's the most important thing. No, the most important thing is so they don't slide down. You know what I mean? It's the worst. Let's try on the first pair. The first pair is by Isabel Maternity by Ingrid and Isabel. This is $29.99. This is their high rise crossover panel skinny maternity jeans. I picked up a US size four and a six, depending how I'm gonna fit in either one. Let's try them on, cause they look, I like the color of them. They're very stretchy. So this first pair from Target, I would say they're definitely more on the jegging side. There's no substance and right, <laughs> right here, <laughs> there's so much extra fabric that it just, the way it folds and sags, it looks really, weird i will say stick to your true size if like you're further along in your pregnancy and they also say on their label stick with your pre-pregnancy jean size that's why i'm with the four and i feel like i could have still went down a size especially right here because there's just so much extra fabric there is like no support nothing is like really holding the belly right here on the lower part of the belly <laughs> but i do like the crossover panel in the back kind of gives it a little breeziness <laughs> I do like the color of these jeans. I think they're really pretty. I think the one thing they're lacking are pockets in the front. So that's why I'm saying they're not really jeans technically. They're more like jeggings, leggings in a way, but just in a jean form. I wish I had front pockets. It does have real pockets in the back. So that's really nice. They're super stretchy, very comfortable. And the panel is really nice, but I'm walking just right here for the video. And I'm really like hiking them up every single time because again, there's no support right underneath the belly and behind, <laughs> like in, on your back. So there's no support whatsoever. I would actually wear a belly band on top of these jeans so they would stay up all day long. So I don't have to keep hiking them, you know, every five minutes or every time I walk. The length, if you are shorter like myself, if you're wearing boots, I think the length is totally fine. If you're gonna wear these jeans with sneakers, flip flops, heels, you might wanna get them hemmed or just roll them up in a way because they are pretty long. So you can see that <laughs> they're like scrunched towards the bottom, but I think it looks totally fine with a pair of boots. My biggest complaint, there is no support, there is no structure. So these are like a legging in a jean form, so jeggings. Let's move on to the second pair. This next pair is by Motherhood and this is their Indigo Blue Secret Fit Belly Stretch Ankle Maternity Jeggings. So they do definitely feel like jeggings like the ones from Target, but they're even thinner. <laughs> so I'm really intrigued. Price, $49.98. We picked up a size small. 58% cotton, 21% rayon, 13% modal, 6% polyester, and then 2% spandex. And then the waistband is 84% nylon with 16% spandex. Let's give these a go. Okay. They're $50 jeans. I don't think they're worth above five. I have leggings that are thicker than these jeans. I can't technically call them jeans because even they don't call them jeans, they call them jeggings. But these are not even jeggings. These are very, 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 very light tights that look like jeans that have a little bit of that like cotton material. I will say they're super, super comfortable. They're very soft. But again, there's no structure. There's no support. This band is a joke. Literally, this is like stockings, like tights, but like the cheapest tights I've ever tried. Like, I think they look not bad. I like the color. It has a raw hem towards the bottom. You have these oddly cut holes that I think someone literally just took a pair of scissors. <laughs> they try to distress them. There's a little bit of distressing on the sides, which is pretty, it's flattering. They are skinny and they are on the longer side. So because they're already a raw hem, I would just cut them off to like my height. But because I don't like them, these are definitely going back. But I'm just really disappointed with the quality of these jeans. I expected a lot more, especially from the reviews. This next pair is from Old Navy and I'm excited for these because they actually look like and feel like a pair of jeans. This is their maternity front low panel OG straight jeans, price $55.99. Picked up size US 4, materials 94% cotton, 5% recycled cotton and 1% spandex, waistband 92% polyester and 8% spandex. Let's put these on. Hopefully these ones will look really cute because they look really cute. The old navy jeans, I think we've hit the gold mine, the gold pot, whatever you want to call it. These are actually really nice and this is what I'm looking from maternity jeans. 
I want an actual pair of jeans that feel like jeans, you know? They have a little bit of stretch to them, but they're nice, like heavyweight cotton. They look like jeans, they sound like jeans, they feel like jeans, but they're still really comfy. And I actually really like the front, the lower panel. It's really thick, really compressive, but stretchy to a point where it can grow with your belly as you are, you know, getting further along in your pregnancy. I love the back of these jeans because they're like a good medium to high rise, especially where they hit in the back. So I like that they're supportive in the back and when they go a little bit lower to the sides, like right here around your waist, where the belly meets the jeans, they're nice and compressive, so they kind of hold you in, which actually feels really good for the belly because you want the extra support. And then this band, it kind of goes right underneath and it just holds everything together. So it feels really, really good and supportive. Walking around here, I didn't hike them up as much as I thought I would have to. So definitely stick with your true size pre-pregnancy and I think you'll feel really supported. I like the color of these jeans. They definitely have quite a bit of stretch to them so you're not gonna feel uncomfortable wearing these jeans all day long. They're not gonna be tight anywhere. They just feel really good. They have real pockets in the front, which like I was telling Jackie and Andre, I love that. It makes me feel good. It makes me feel put together. You know, I can actually put my hands in my front pockets, not just in the back. So I appreciate that. For sizing, like I said, stick to your true pre-pregnancy size or just whatever feels good when you're pregnant. But I will say, because you're sticking to your pre-pregnancy size, it kind of just holds everything together. And I did get the short version, so the inseam is perfect for me right now. There is a short, there's a regular, and then there's tall inseam, which is, I think, phenomenal. But I feel like if you're like me and you love jeans during pregnancy, not all the time, but sometimes you want to put jeans on, definitely check out Old Navy because these ones are phenomenal and I'm very happy with the price very happy with the quality. I think these are great. Phenomenal, I need more colors in this. And these are what, like five bucks more than the last pair? Let's move on to the next pair. This next pair is by Abercrombie and Fitch. They actually have maternity jeans now. This is their maternity ankle straight jeans, price $89. I picked up a US size 27 short. The materials, 99% cotton with 1% elastane, and then the waistband is 86% polyester and 14% elastane. So these jeans have the most cotton, so they definitely feel like the most heavyweight pair of jeans, but still nice and soft and stretchy. So let's try these on and I will give you a spoiler alert. I've been wearing them for already a day and a half. <laughs> I wore them yesterday and I wore them today and they are very comfortable. I do have some things to say about them, but let's see how they look. So the waistband is actually very different than the jeans that I've been trying out. So you actually have a pair of jeans that goes all the way around and they're super like low rise, but a little higher rise in the back. But then the waistband is actually stitched on the inside, like the belly band is stitched on the inside of the jeans. So it looks like you're wearing a pair of jeans with like a belly band which was really, really intriguing to me when these first arrived because I was really confused how they would fit. But they actually fit really good. Definitely, again, stick to your pre-pregnancy jean size because I feel like that's where you're gonna get the best fit and the best feel for your belly, all that support. I do like the color. I like the distressed knees. Again, something with the knees, they're like different heights, but I think they look fine. And I do like the length on me as well. The hem is a little bit distressed, but it's not completely raw. But the one thing I have, I have a little bone to pick with these jeans. This part right here, because this is a fake button, they just kind of stick out because, you know, when you sit down, your belly kind of just wants to put the jeans down a little bit. So when you walk, this button looks a little awkward. You have real pockets. I just, I appreciate everything with these jeans. Honestly, if you wanted to, you could even wear a pair, like a belt with these <laughs> jeans to get even more support. But the one thing I like about these, and I didn't think I would, was this band. This band is so stretchy and it's so thin, but it's also compressive. And because it's stitched inside the jeans, not on top, it's stitched inside. So it's essentially sitting right underneath your belly and it's just kind of hiking it up. And the jeans are on top of the belly band and they're kind of just holding everything together. Super comfortable, so I can report that they are very comfortable. They do stretch out a little bit, especially towards the thigh and the knees, but they are 99% cotton, so they are gonna stretch with you the more you wear them. But I like them. I think I'm gonna pick up a black pair. 
when they go on sale. Let's try on the next pair. These next ones are from Madewell, and this is their maternity over the belly perfect vintage jeans in banner wash. $138, so we're jumping up in price. Size 27, materials 99% cotton with 1% spandex. And again, these ones are like the Abercrombie ones where they have the least amount of spandex in them and the most amount of cotton. Oh, I don't think I'm gonna like the heels. <sighs> they don't have pockets. And then the waistband, the belly band is like stitched over the jeans. <laughs> Let's put them on. Okay, that was right. I don't like these jeans. <laughs> they have no support no structure right here just because the belly band is sewn on top of the jeans and so thin right here that there's nothing holding right underneath the belly and even in the back they're just they're doing weird it's doing weird stuff all around right here they do feel like jeans like the actual jean for the legs part it feels like a vintage heavyweight material. I think the look is pretty cool. It has that vintage kind of acid look, even though they're not acid washed, but they have that vintage look to them. They are definitely on the longer side of the inseam, but they look pretty good with boots. I do like the look of that. They're very clean. They're not distressed and they're pretty comfortable. I would say the Abercrombie ones are a little bit softer of material, even though they're both 99% cotton, but yeah, I'm just not impressed with these whatsoever. They're just so thin right underneath the belly. And then the band, it's so high up. It's definitely meant for people with longer torsos. It's hiked all the way up here and it's not really holding up. It's not really supporting anything. Again, I'm very disappointed with the these pair of jeans. Maybe I could go down a size, but just because of the material of the band and just this, from the jeans to the belly band, the way it's transitioning. It doesn't look great, it doesn't feel great. So I'm pretty disappointed with how comfortable and how functional these jeans really are, especially for the price. This last pair is by Paige and this is their Noella straight maternity jeans, priced at 239 US dollars, size 27, materials 98% cotton and 2% elastane. These are the only jeans besides the Old Navy that look like a pair of jeans all the way around and they have loopholes, also the Abercrombie ones, but these have the side elastic panels, which I honestly prefer in a pair of maternity jeans because I find that they grow the best with your belly, they have the most support, and again, they look like a really nice pair of jeans, you know what I mean? But let's try these on and let's see how they look, how they fit, and how they compare to the other pair of jeans. For this last pair that's super expensive. I'm a little underwhelmed. Let's start off first with the size. I think they're true to size. They look really good on. They still have a little bit of room to them. They're super stretchy. They're definitely more of that straight cut where it looks a little bit more baggy. They're not super tight around your waist, around your thighs, your knees, and your ankles. But I will say some, something weird is happening right here on the like my hips. There's like this extra fabric. The waist panel combined with the hips. So, so it's kind of just sticking awkwardly and you can kind of feel it on the inside as well. I will say these jeans are super, super soft. They only have 2% spandex, so they're 98% cotton, but they're so stretchy and they're so soft. They're kind of like that buttery jean feel, but they have still a lot of substance and structure to them. Another thing I will say, these are the only pair of jeans that actually have a real button and they have a real zipper. So with the side panels, it's like a pair of jeans where you don't just slip into, you actually have to undo and then zip up, which I think feels really good and it's it looks really nice. But I also feel like they could have totally added front pockets to these jeans to make them look even more like real pair of jeans. For $240, where are my front pockets? Another thing I will say about these pair of jeans, I wish the back of the jeans, they they rose a little bit higher, but they are, they're very, very comfy. They're very stretchy on the side and they definitely will grow with you and your belly. So I really appreciate that. But for $240, I'm not happy with how they're looking and how they're fitting. All right, I'm gonna leave it here. My two favorite pairs, Old Navy, Abercrombie. Old Navy, I love the lower front panel. I think it's phenomenal. Just one thing, I do have to wear longer shirts and sweaters with those pair of jeans, but I like the look, I like the fit, I like that they're clean, I like that they're classic, but they still have a really good ruggedness to them. I can dress them up, I can dress them down, and 
they're pretty inexpensive. I love that. And they have different inseams that you can choose as well. And I'm pretty sure they have different color options. I hope they have a pair of black, maybe white, maybe distressed. I'm gonna go shop on Old Navy, do some more shopping. And then Abercrombie, I think their jeans just in general are great. They're really great quality. They wash well, they wear well, and they last for years. So I'm hoping the maternity ones are gonna be great as well. And I wanna pick up their black version. They're more skinny and like a raw hem towards the bottom. But there are some really great options nowadays. It's not like, you know, <laughs> the second pair. <laughs> that doesn't even look like jeans. So that's the whole point of this video. Are there actual jeans that look good, that look like a pair of jeans, that feel like a pair of jeans, but are very comfortable and they're supportive for your growing belly? I'm gonna leave it here. Thank you for watching, spending time with me, and I'll see the next one very soon. Bye.